1,000 years ago, superstition and the sword ruled. It was a time of darkness. It was a world of fear. It was the age of gargoyles. Stone by day, warriors by night. We were betrayed by the humans we had sworn to protect. Frozen in stone by a magic spell for a thousand years. Now here in Manhattan, the spell is broken and we live again. We are defenders of the night. We are gargoyles. Previously on Gargoyles. The Gargoyles have outlived their usefulness. I can't count on their loyalty. Attack. My steel clan isn't performing as well as I had hoped. I think it's time for an update on our project, Severius. You asked me to genetically design a living creature based on a gargoyle. I considered cloning a living specimen, but none was available. Or has that changed? No, it is not. A thousand years ago, this castle was yours to protect. But it belongs to Xanatos now. Before he's released from prison, you need to find a new home. This one is lost to you. Not without a fight. A Steel Clan robot! Get back! I thought you destroyed them all. Apparently, I missed one. Elisa, Xanatos will never drive us from our home. You've been wounded. It's nothing. You've got some explaining to do. My sincere apologies. There was a freak overload in its power matrix. Before we could take the unit offline, it broke free. This should be attended to. <sighs> He's right, Goliath. No sense taking unnecessary chances. Sorry, boys. I owe you big time. It's okay. If some voice over the phone told me the power plant was going to melt down tonight, I wouldn't have taken any chances either. Thanks, guys. You're real troopers. Ah! Lex, you two all right? Something hit us! It's got me! Ah! Lex, what's going on up there? Ah! Ah! Whoa, that was close. You okay, Lisa? What happened? I'm not sure. Something forced me off the... Goliath? <laughs> 50,000 down as agreed. You'll receive the balance upon completion. I do hope you and your group can deliver. Don't swear the Dr. Severius. For the right price, we could lift the Venus de Milo out of the Louvre. But it would be easier at night. No, it wouldn't. Uh, trust me on that. And when the thunder passed, Goliath was gone. Well, you should have heard his laugh. Make my hair stand on end, if I had any. Hmm, that doesn't sound like the Goliath I know. Tell me about it. No, let's have Goliath tell us about it. Where is he? He and Brooklyn are out on patrol. At least, that's where he said they'd be. The dawn fast approaching, they probably found a ledge to spend the day on. Somewhere Goliath would feel safe. It's nice to have him here guarding the castle. Yes, it is. Come, we've got a full day's work ahead of us. 
the Emir is having trouble meeting your deadline quite a lot. You hear that? Hold your fire. The gargoyle must not be damaged. Is this a plan you've neglected to mention? No. Maybe Demona's behind it. Macbeth, perhaps, or Renard. I've never lacked formidable enemies, but be assured, whoever it was, is going to pay most dearly. We've got the merchandise, Doctor. Xanatos saw us, but he held his fire, as you said he would. Splendid. You'll get the rest of what's coming to you tonight. Meet me at the rendezvous point, but not until after dark. Savarius, out. Something about him gives me the creeps. I don't know what you're talking about. Surely you know I am not in the habit of playing childish pranks or laughing maniacally in the dark. Do you even know how to laugh maniacally? But Goliath, we heard you. We saw you. No, you couldn't have. Goliath was with me all night and we never left Midtown. I don't get it. If Goliath was in Midtown, who was messing with us last night? Watch with the tranquilizer gun. I've never seen a statue that needed to be put to sleep. You have now. Here? Right here. This is where the gargoyle stood when the lightning bolt struck. What's this? Looks like the kind of tracking device Genutech uses. Genutech. Genetic engineering. The creature we saw last night might have been one of theirs. Lexington, you and Broadway pay them a visit. See what you can find out. We're on the case. If Genutech's involved, then Savarius is too. I don't need to remind you who he works for. Let's see if we can find this creature. I believe this is the call you've been expecting, sir. David Xanatos here. At 2 a.m., you will come alone to the offshore oil rig at Black Rock Point for the sum of 20 million dollars in cash. Failure to pay will result in the immediate extermination of your prize specimen. A pity the voice didn't stay on the line for three more seconds. Although there wasn't enough time to trace the call, I've uncovered a certain large consortium which secretly holds the lease on the Black Rock Point oil rig. Cyberbiotics? Xanatos Enterprises. I wish I could say I'm surprised. Savarius? It has to be. Aside from us, the good doctor was the only other person with intimate knowledge of the Thalog project. I hate to lose a resource as fertile as Anton's mind, but I can't tolerate this kind of behavior. An example must be made. The data bank's too big. I have to narrow down the search. How are you going to do that? By guessing. Whatever we saw last night, it looked and sounded just like Goliath, right? Right. So what are you typing? C-L-O-N-E. Cl clone? Clone it is. We're in. The skirmish at the castle was executed flawlessly. Owen reports Goliath never suspected that the rogue robot which caused his injury was activated for one purpose. The extraction of living cell samples. Enough to facilitate a successful cloning procedure. All data indicates my accelerated growth process is overriding the normally slow aging rate. The only side effect seems to be an odd skin and hair pigmentation. A new data indicates the clone has reached full gargoyle adolescence in a mere 19 weeks. The artificial maturation rate has been augmented by an ongoing subliminal education program personally designed by Mr. Xanatos to teach his own unique slant on things. Now that subject is fully grown, it's time for it to leave the nest and take its rightful place in the world. This is bad news, isn't it? You can say that again. This is bad news. A 
I didn't find anything else out of the ordinary. What about that? The oil rig? Looks abandoned. Well, someone seems to have found a new use for it. There you are. And as prompt as ever, too. Ah, yes, the blood money. You are playing this to the hilt. Mind if I have a peek? You're the kidnapper. I guess I am at that. Glorious. I, I didn't even know they made bills in $10,000 denominations. You know, Anton, I'm not by nature a vengeful man. But your behavior has forced me to make an exception. What would put Xanatos and Savarius at each other's throats? Let's not interrupt them just yet. I want to look inside. I, I don't understand, sir. What did I do wrong? Kidnapping, extortion, betrayal. Where would you like me to start? Oh, I get it. We're being watched. Is that it? Very well. Yes! I betrayed you. You robbed me of my greatest creation, my ultimate achievement. I only took back what was mine. There, how is that? You hear that? The oil tank. Goliath, it's you at last. I am Thalog. What? What kind of abomination are you? The same kind as you. It was your blood that spawned me. My blood! Oh my gosh. He's a clone. They grew him from a piece of you, like a cutting from a plant. A piece of me? This thing is me! First Xanatos steals my home, and now he pieces off my soul! You've got every right to be angry, but no right to take it out on Thalog. What difference does it make how he came into being? Now he's as much a gargoyle as you are. In a way, he's almost your son. How can you reject him? Ah, uh, you're right, of course. If there's anyone to blame here, it's Zamatos, not Thalog. I'm going to set him free. That won't be necessary. The shackles weren't locked. What are you doing? Stop! And just for the record, I'm more of a gargoyle than he'll ever be. <laughs> Doctor, what makes you think this is all just an act? It's you, Mr. Xanatos, and your instructions. What are you talking about? The orders came from your office by electronic mail. Prepping this rig, hiring the mercenaries, the ransom corps, you planned every detail. I just assumed the subterfuge was part of a Machiavellian scheme against one of your enemies. You assumed incorrectly. But if you weren't calling the shots, who was? Owen? Fox, don't be ridiculous. Who else had access to the castle? Well, what do you know? The kid turned out to be a real chip off the old block. Indeed, he did. Ah! All the old blocks. I'm impressed they lost. You played Savarius like a harp. But if money was the bottom line, why not just ask? We could have come to an arrangement. Maybe on your terms, not mine. Did you really expect me to spend my life being your stooge and the doctor's private guinea pig? You two didn't go to all of this trouble just to raise a fool. Typical. You do and do and do for them, and what happens? They twist the knife in you. Uh, don't tempt me. Time to go. I've got plans of my own and twenty million dollars to see them through. <laughs> so, how are you going to spend it? Stroll into a bank and open a checking account? I'll find a way to make it work for me. I set all this up, didn't I? Thalog, don't go down that path. Money is a necessary evil in Xanatos' world, but not in ours. Join us. Join your clan. And waste my life playing guardian angel night after night to a decrepit city infested with inferior humans? Where is the profit in that? Life for a gargoyle isn't about profit. It's about protecting those you care for. 
I considered caring about you. It took some effort, but I arranged for you to join this party because I planned to share the money with you. But our little family reunion disappointed me, Father. So I've decided to hate you, too. Well, it's a shame about you, my dear. I'm afraid you were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. It goes with the job. A uh, shame about her? What's that supposed to mean? He means for us to die, Doctor. Die? This rig is not as empty as it looks. My first visit out here, I found 200 gallons of stored oil topside. A fact that doesn't bode well for the four of you. On my way out, I'm going to open those tanks. Flood the platform with oil. The flare gun? Will be my parting shot. I can't wait to see all three of my proud fathers go out in a fiery blaze of glory. <laughs> I love a woman with delicate wrists. You work with handcuffs as much as I do. You pick up a few tricks. How does that help us? She can't break our chains. Goliath can. No, he can't. I created the gas Thalog used on Goliath. It was designed to leave him weak and helpless for hours. Elisa, he's right. You must flee while you have the chance. And leave you to die with these two, please. Unfortunately, the magnetic disc Thalog hit me with shorted out my armor. That leaves me powerless, too. That's it! The disc! The disc may be our salvation, if it still carries a charge. Then it might adrenalize Goliath enough to offset the gas and restore his strength. Detective, if you do the honors. I don't like this at all. Elisa, do we have a choice? Now I know where I got the temper. <laughs> Thalog wasn't kidding. One spark and the whole rig goes up like a Roman candle. The launch is this way. Go with them, Elisa. I have to face Thalog alone. No, Goliath. Please, Elisa. He is of my blood. He is my son. It's not too late, Thalog. You can wipe the slate clean. Start over. Over my dead body, or better yet, yours. copy could live up to the original. That copy was a living being. And we all failed him. We have company. What do we miss? Let's just say it's been a long night. We had a busy night, too. We learned a whole lot about Thalog. So did we, guys. So did we. It's unfortunate you couldn't prevent all that ransom money from burning up, sir. That 20 million would just about cover the installation of a more secure computer system for the corporation. What makes you so sure the 20 million went up in smoke, sir? It didn't occur to me till just now, but if I had been in Thalog's shoes, I would have had a contingency plan for escaping that oil rig. I would have known that faking my own death was the optimum means of escaping scot-free with all those millions. You mean that creature is still out there? It has the money, it's as powerful as Goliath, and it's smarter than you, Owen? 
I think I've created a monster. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,